Now, this is the, what, sixth of the, the Resident sixth Evil movies? The sixth Resident Evil, the final this chapter. Is the final, and is it really the final chapter? Is, is it, it really? Is it really the final chapter? It is. This is really um, Alice's story coming full circle. And, I mean, it's the biggest and the best. It's terrifying. Mm -hmm. I watched it for the third time at the Tokyo premiere, and I was jumping like crazy. My husband's turning to me, he's like, but you're in the movie. <laughs> like, why are you jumping? You know it's gonna happen, but it's scary, I'm telling you. Your husband's crazy. directed all yes, of the movies, yes. right? And, and wrote them, yeah. But you weren't married when he started, correct? Oh, no, when no. we started, I was 24, I was single. Sorry, baby. So. <laughs> I was having fun. Did you audition for him? I assume you I did. I did, I did, because yeah. I was a big fan of the game. My little brother and I would play the game all the time. So, you know, I really wanted the part, you know, for, for, for a few reasons. I mean, not many movies are made in Hollywood with these strong female leads. That was one of them. But also, I mean, for my little brother, for me to be the girl from Resident Evil was like full kudos in school. Did he, yeah, he was oh, excited by that? He was like popular for at least like a month. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's very it's very fleeting, isn't it? It is. So in a way, you were not just auditioning for your husband auditioned you to be his wife in a way, if you think about it. I, I mean, mean, listen, it wasn't so easy for him. It wasn't. I, yeah. I, I made it hard. He's he's an amazing guy. I mean, when, he's put up with a lot. When he is directing a film, do you listen to him or is it like eh, all right, it's just, <laughs> you know, you know it's really husband. funny. I had a friend come up to me and, you know, Paul had come up and, and said something like, can you do this differently? And, and she comes up to me and she's like, if my husband ever told me to do something differently, I would like read him, blah, blah, blah. I was like, well, uh, I mean, listen, it, he's the director. I mean, I'm an actor. I enjoy, you know, making their vision come true. I right. mean, it's part of my job. Right, yeah, yeah. And right. I, I mean, listen, he, he gives us a lot of freedom and, and we do things that he likes and then, you know. Do you ever punish him? He doesn't him like. If you're yes, angry? Yes, I did. You do, oh. I, but I wasn't angry, it was an accident, but I did punch him in the eye once. Oh, you did? <laughs> no, I didn't say punch. In a big shiner, but no, because he I was said, like, we were rehearsing and he's like. Oh. <laughs> Not punch him. <laughs> Do you ever punch your husband? <laughs> yes, I do, actually. Wow, what a coincidence. <laughs> so you punch, what do you punch? Why would you punch the director? How does that happen by accident? It's an action movie. So, I see. you know, accidents do happen. <laughs> I mean, there's like inherent danger involved. But he, he kind of set himself up. He was standing like this close to me and he's kind of doing the director's thing. Like he's like, okay, punch towards the lens, meaning the lens is my face. So I, I, I did. Mm -hmm. And then <laughs> knocked him square in the eye. You know, he, yeah. had, he had a black eye for a couple of weeks. Yeah, oh, well, how about it that? It was quite a cute story for him to tell everyone that comes on set. Hmm. Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel. If you like that, click the subscribe button below, and good things will happen forever.